I want to point out for those of you that know directional things, yes, we are now indeed walking the other direction. Not because I was lost, but there's something nice about walking down the same street back and forth. Right, Mike? Yep. Tell people how absolutely enjoyable it is for you to be in Japan with me. It's amazing. It's amazing. How much money would you pay me for this trip if I had, if I charged you? The amount that it costs to like travel and stuff. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. It's worth probably. it. All right, cool. Well, mundane discussions of old Japanese ladies. Did you understand anything they said? Something like that. It's weird. It seems really early in the day, but it's 3.30. All right, well, this is your morning tour of Katsushika. If you are coming to Japan and you're looking for an Airbnb and wondering if Katsushika is a decent location, it actually is. Yeah, it is. I, I like it. It's quiet, it's nice, there's enough restaurants and it's got good access to the city. Where are we going, Mike? Uh, Tokyo. <laughs> yeah, this is an exciting vlog right here, just walking down a dark Japan street with nothing happening. But a guy like uh, hiding in my room, mm -hmm. 20,000 views in like an hour. For this? Yeah, here, I'll do, a, I'll do one of his videos. <sighs> my wife is such a bitch. She totally kicked me out. Okay, I'm gonna have to drop the accent. My wife is such a bitch. All I did was said I want to fuck every whore in Japan, and she kicked me out of the house. I have no shoes right now. I'm totally shoeless, okay? I mean, can you believe my wife kicking me out of the house that I pay half the rent in? All because I said the truth. She said I should be honest, so I just told her I want to fuck all the whores. Why would that be a problem? Just cause I fucked some whores. Anyway, I got my YouTube plaque today for 100,000. And I put the channel name on there, my wife's a bitch, and she hates me for it. But what she doesn't understand is that's why I got 200,000. It's the drama of the channel. And I just wanted to, I was saying thank my bitch wife was the, it's like congratulations to thank my bitch wife, you got 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. She doesn't even appreciate it. All the things I do for her. And I can't fuck some whores? Seriously, this is why Japan is doomed. This is why they're doomed. Okay, we have arrived in Shibuya. We're getting ready to get to the Hachiko exit, which is where that famous dog is. Getting ready to meet uh, a guy named Tim, which I believe I met last time when I was here. And Melanie, who I've never met, but I've talked to a lot. We'll see if we're actually gonna be friends in real life. All right, so we're heading to the Shakey's Pizza. They have an all-you-can-eat. All right, this is the famous crossing at Shibuya. I don't think I've been here in the rain in a long time. I wonder how many people in a year lose their eyes because of umbrellas. I'm gonna warn you, I feel like I'm not going the right direction. But I don't get lost in Tokyo ever, never. It's close though. Oh, it's here. It's been here for 20 years. I know it's around here. All right, that was Shakey's. We found it. Now we're gonna go get some sweets. Right? Yep. All right guys, just hung out for a few hours at this really amazing place here called Scramble right outside the Shibuya station. It's fantastic for meeting new friends. I highly recommend it. Thank you, Tim, for showing it to me. All right, everybody, we have arrived in, where are we? We have arrived in Nara. 
is a beautiful onsen hotel and the onsen is open pretty much like literally all night until 10 a.m. in the morning and then it closes for maintenance until 3 in the afternoon which means practically any time of the night we can go we just spent like an hour in there hanging out and now we're heading to go do some karaoke or as you guys even like to say karaoke here we'll we'll flip around and we'll show you what's happening in nara all right something happened very early very fun in this store well, that was kind of fun uh here go ahead and listen to this very special song everyone just listen to this song but it, it'll roll over again it's like repeating like constantly in this I think you'll appreciate that. Oh, right there's a karaoke place right there. Like, so these have like these, these are, are private rooms. Yeah. この回にはたまりません。最低1時間だけど2時間、2時間で2アワーズ1。うーん、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、
All right, let's head back on down. Yeah, Mike, uh, Mike has a, he's like a really fantastic musician. And I guess he used to have a really amazing voice and he heard it, like kind of hurt his throat. So it really bothers him. So it's a little bit nervous for him to sing. He hasn't, I never heard him sing. I think he's a little bit nervous about that. At least he's just said he was. Let's see what happens here. Dude, your voice is amazing. I'm why are you always super nervous? Why are you worried about your voice? It's amazing. Yeah, Sounds good. Thanks. I'll never sing in front of you again. Fuck you. Yours is good too. Oh, shut up. That was good. E pitch doesn't. Oh, come on. <laughs> you had a very nice voice. I don't think you ever actually hurt your voice. How about that? I don't think you ever ever hurt your face. <laughs> Alrighty, we're done. It's been a while since I've seen you. I've sung a few months, but it was fun. This elevator's quiet. It's really quiet. That's amazing. Or our ears are completely shot. Maybe. <laughs> the two. I can't hear anything. Are you talking to me? Did you just say something? Oh, mama. Oh, mama. Looks so pretty. It looks in the thing. I wonder if it looks that pretty for real. Like when we take down the footage. I mean, it looks pretty in real life. All right. So let's talk about some words that you need to know in karaoke. Yoyaku. Which means to reserve your song. If it says, obviously you have to read the kanji, but genki means the original key. And then you can move it up, shop, move it down, furato, but normally there's, there's um, arrows up and down. You can figure it out. You can just tell your friend it's too high, you can drop it, tell them you want it up higher, whatnot. Also, this is like karaoke etiquette. You're really not supposed to sing two songs in a row. If you have a big group of people, definitely that's a no no. If you're with a friend, you can say, hey, can I sing two songs in a row? But normally you don't. The only problem with karaoke is like someone's like singing their ass off and you're just looking for your next song. And it looks like you don't give a shit. When your friend looks over, you do have to act like you're really into the song. That's, that's the rule, right, Mike? And you just gotta act like, you know. Like Mike was like, I'm just gonna go to the bathroom. I'm like, no, 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 it's the song, dude. Like you can't go to the bathroom when your friend's singing their ass off.